Goshen suffers extensive tornado damage, state of emergency declared. The Red Cross has set up a shelter at Goshen High School, 6707 Goshen Road. Food, water, and shelter are being provided. Pets are welcome, they will be kept in a separate area. Goshen is under a state of emergency after a confirmed radar indicated tornado ripped through northern Claremont County Wednesday afternoon. There is extensive damage to hundreds of homes, according to Township Administrator Stephen Pegram. The majority of the damage is from trees falling on or going through homes and roofs being blown off. Some structures, according to Pegram, are totally demolished. At this point we know that a tornado hit Goshen. We don't know how severe the tornado was. We have extensive damage in what we refer to as downtown Goshen and in the outskirts heading south, Pegram said. There are two confirmed injuries at this time, a firefighter injured by a chainsaw and a civilian injured by debris. The injuries are minor, and both are conscious. The fact that we do not have a lot of injuries or any fatalities is a blessing, Pegram said, adding he's been involved in deadly tornado responses before. I think Goshen got lucky, but we have a lot of damage and a lot of people hurting right now. An early Red Cross assessment includes the following areas in the damage zone, Goshen proper, Goshen Township, the Lakeshore Estates Mobile Home Park in Loveland in Claremont County. Impacts also exist in Indiana, Kentucky and Central Ohio, but in significantly smaller numbers, According to a Red Cross spokesperson, Point One Goshen Fire Department building took a direct hit, according to Pegram. The hope is to have part of that building reopened Wednesday night. We have extensive damage to one of our fire stations and extensive damage to our police station, which obviously has caused an issue with coordinating a response, he said. A regional command post is set up. The city is receiving mutual aid from police, fire, and EMS agencies from several surrounding counties. Ohio State Highway Patrol is on scene assisting with traffic. The tornado touched down around 3.30 p.m. as part of a large storm front that swept across the tri-state.